Hello, I'm Norman Tebbett. I want to tell you very briefly about the introduction you're going to see to a most extraordinarily interesting film, The Norway Option, which shows how Norway has conducted a successful relationship outside the European Union, but close to it. Watch the trailer. And I hope that will make you want to watch the whole film, The Norway Option. For 40 years, the British Parliament has been handing over our sovereignty to the European Union. Now, with a referendum on our continued membership a possibility, how would we get out? This new film provides some of the answers. First, it shows that the Lisbon Treaty signed here at the Geronimos Monastery in 2007, gives Britain an escape clause. Yes, for, for you sceptics, the Lisbon Treaty is the game changer. Yes. It changes yes. everything. Yes. The route is recognised by the leader of UKIP, Nigel Farage. Article 50, an acceptable route. We need to enter into this divorce with a spirit of doing it legally and doing it amicably, uh, but the European Union and Brussels itself will need uh, to play fair for the bargain too. Next, the film shows overwhelming public support for leaving, as well as an alternative. I think they should give us a vote on whether we can come out of Europe. Well, that's oh, yeah. a key issue, isn't We it? need to get out of Europe, issue. absolutely. Yeah. I'm dead against it, but they won't let us. Politicians in this country don't have any power to make any decisions anyway. I mean, it's all done from Europe. Whatever they say, it's all overridden by Europe. They can't do anything. They're stuck. Thirdly, the film compares Britain with Norway, a country which twice voted against membership nearly 20 years ago. The people of Norway decided not to join the European Union. I'm going to talk to some people and find out how they've got on. And would we, in the United Kingdom, be better off not a part of the European Union. If you go back to 1972 when you joined the European Union, you were together with Norway and Switzerland and others in another trade and negotiating uh, area. And if you consider that again, we have a kind of North Atlantic cooperation. The Norwegian people have voted no twice. Uh, twi two referendums we've had and the Norwegian people have said no twice. There's absolutely no one in the Norwegian debate that wants to join the EU and, and there is a vast majority in the Norwegian public that does not want EU membership and not only that but they want uh, less integration with the EU. Watch the Norway option and you can see that Britain really does have a better future as an independent nation.